Hello there, I am Miss Rina and now we are going to talk with you about next type. So, our plan for today is to learn what is mixed type, what is its structure, when we use it, then we will look at some examples and in the end we will do some practice. So, let's talk about mixed type. Mixed conditionals are a combination of two types of conditional patterns, usually second and third conditionals. We can have a third conditional in the if clause and a second in, in the main clause, or a second conditional in the if clause and a third conditional in the main clause. They are used to describe a hypothetical or unreal situation in the present or future that is connected to a hypothetical or unreal situation in the past. In other words, mixed conditionals describe a present or future situation that is the result of a past hypothetical event that did not actually happen. Let's look at one example. If I had married him, had married third type, I would live happy now, would live second type. We wouldn't be lost if we had looked at the map. This type of mixed conditionals refers to an unreal past condition and its probable results in the present. This sentence expresses a situation which is contrary to reality, both in the past and in the present. In these mixed conditional sentences, the time is in the past in the if clause and in the present in the main clause. If I had studied, I would have my driving license. But I didn't study and I don't now have my license. In this sentence, mixed conditionals, you can also use models in the main clause mm -hmm. instead of would to express the degree of certainty, permission or a recommendation about the outcome. Now let's talk about structure. Okay, first we have if plus type 2, past simple, and type 3 would have with verb 3, and if plus type 3, past perfect, and type 2, would plus verb. If I hadn't got the job in Tokyo, I wouldn't be with my current partner. Here is a sentence imagining how a change in a past situation would have a result in the present Another example. It's really important. If it wasn't, I wouldn't have called you on your holiday. Here's a sentence imagining how a different situation in the present would mean that the past was different as well. Now let's look at some cases of using. So first, past action with present result. This type of mixed conditional is used to describe a hypothetical present or future result that is the consequence of a past action that did not actually happen. This type of mixed conditional deals with changing a past action and its hypothetical present or future result. However, it's important to note that the result cannot actually happen because we cannot change the past. If I had finished high school, I would be a college student now. Present condition with past result. The second type of mixed conditional is used to imagine a hypothetical present situation that is the result of a past action that did not actually happen. If she were more hardworking, she would have succeeded. Future action with past result. This type of mixed conditional is used to describe a hypothetical situation in the present or 
future, that is the results of a past action that did not actually happen. It helps us to explore how the present or future could be different if we had acted differently in the past. Imagine that you are a soccer player and tomorrow you have an important match. You will probably stay home the night before the match, eat a healthy dinner and try to be well rested. So here you might say, if I didn't have an important match tomorrow, I would have stayed up late. And now let's look at some examples. If he hadn't missed the flight, he would be enjoying his vacation right now. If she had studied harder, she would have passed the exam. If we had chosen a different road, we wouldn't be stuck in traffic. Mm -hmm. If I were better at cooking, I would have prepared dinner tonight. If he had taken that job offer, he might be earning more money now. They would probably have a larger house if they had invested wisely. Okay, it's time for practice. Here you should complete this, the sentences with the correct mixed conditional form. If she hadn't missed her flight, she be here by now. If he studied harder in the past, he would have a better job now. If they had taken the earlier train, they not miss the meeting. If we hadn't moved to the city, we never meet our current friends. And second task, you should choose the correct form of mixed conditional for each sentence. If she studied harder in school, she speaks fluent French now. If they save money, more money, they be able to afford the vacation last summer. If he not lose his keys, he not need to call a locksmith. If we have more free time, we or is it the museum? If it's not rain yesterday, we go for a hike. Put the pause and make two tasks, okay? Let's check. If she hadn't missed her flight, she would be here by now. If he hadn't studied harder in the past, he would have a better job now. If they had taken the earlier train, they would not have missed the meeting. If we hadn't moved to another city, we would, have, we would never have met our current friends. And second, if she had studied harder in school, she would speak fluent French now. If they had saved more money, they would have been able to afford a vacation last summer. If he hadn't lost his keys, he wouldn't have needed to call a locksmith. If we had had more time, we would have visited the museum. If it hadn't rained yesterday, we would have gone for a hike. Great, okay. And next, should you hear, you should hear you write the following sentences using the mixed conditional form. She didn't buy the dress and now she regrets it. Tom doesn't know how to play the guitar now because he didn't practice in the past. They don't have enough money to travel now because they spent it all before. The team lost the match because they didn't train properly. She's not good at public speaking because she didn't practice it in the past. And next task. Here you should complete the sentences with the correct mixed conditional. If I know you were coming, I bake a cake. If they not miss the train, they already arrive at the party. If he have more experience, he solved the problem easily. 
If she be more careful, she not break her horn. If we meet earlier, we discuss the project in more detail. Okay, put the pause and do these tasks, please. Mm -hmm. Now let's go and check. Exercise 3. If she had bought the dress, she would regret it now. Tom had practiced the guitar in the past. He, if Tom had practiced the guitar in the past, he would know now how to play it now. He would know how to play it now. If they had spent all their money before, they wouldn't have enough to travel now. If the team had trained properly, they wouldn't have lost the match. If she had practiced published speaking in the past, she would be good at it now. And next exercise. If I had known you were coming, I would have baked a cake. If they hadn't missed the train, they would have already arrived at the party. If he had more experience, he would have solved the problem easily. If she had been more careful, she wouldn't have broken her phone. If we had met earlier, we would have discussed the project in more detail. And this is the end of our lesson. Thank you and bye-bye.